can see straight through my light Oh, there's something in my chest that I can't hide When feelings get involved, I'm terrified Cause I've been here before and said goodbye Hello everyone, great to be with you from the West Coast, specifically Dignity Health Sports Park here in Southern California. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And we're fully convinced this game will live up to its billing. It's the United States up against Portugal. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Here's how it looks for the United States. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Well, they're also playing in a 4-3-3 formation, but they play it in a slightly different way, particularly in the wide areas, where their fullbacks will get forward and rotate with the wingers at every opportunity. And now they get the ball rolling. Moving it forward. Now he must favour the cross. Good strength to keep the ball. Might be able to get in behind the defence. And using his body to good effect. You know, when Ronaldo is on the pitch, we tend to think he'll stamp his authority on the game, Stuart. What in particular do you expect to see from him this time around? Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. Very good reading of the game to win possession back. And play halted, free kick given. He plays it short. Palinha. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful.
Well, a long-distance effort and a highly respectable one, Stuart. Well, he surprised everybody, including me. It's a decent effort, you have to say. Palinha. Offside, a tight one. Ariola. And now Roldan. It might still be problematic. He's blocked it. And Portugal moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Ariola. And it's with McKenney. Well, nicely cut out. Putting his body on the line. And he read it well. Oh, in with a chance. And there it is. The breakthrough that will do nicely. Well, here we can see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and then it's a pretty tidy finish, too. Hits it hard, he hits it low, and it just makes it difficult for the keeper. A really nice goal. So the ball is moving again. Will there be a quick response from Portugal here? There needs to be. Renato Sanchez. Ricardo Esgallo. And the ball with Pedro Gonzalves. Palinha. Ronaldo. Really good diving save. <laughs> Trying to pick out a teammate. Well cleared away. Guerrero. So after that, a goal kick it'll be. Possession given away, unfortunately. Well, there you can see it. The hosts haven't been able to control possession, but their counter-attacking has been really good, particularly in the wide areas. It's been an excellent performance from them so far. It didn't quite go to plan. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Renato Sanchez. Palinha. The ball with Podens. Guerrero. 
considerable momentum courtesy of Ronaldo but what can he produce from here now able to close down the shot playing with purpose and control oh a superb save well he took care of it defensively well that save could be the turning point here because they've been second best all over the pitch up to now bad pass Well, let's see if something comes of this. Can he finish? Well, a nearly moment just over the top. Palinha. Bruno Fernandes. And the ball with Pedro Gonzalez. Really getting stuck in. And we will have just one additional minute. Roldan. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Substitution time it is. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Spot on with that tackle. He's in behind. He's gone and found the net! Brilliant piece of finishing! Magnificent goal! Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. Back underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. Good work from Portugal to win back possession. Palinha. It's with Guerrero. That's a splendid ball from Ronaldo. Well, unfortunately, he couldn't keep the shot down. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Well, they need to be more positive with their passing. Make more runs in behind the defence, create overloads in the wide areas, and then we may see an improvement in those stats. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Giving it a try. Ronaldo! Magnificent finishing from one of the world's best. Well, here's the replay, and just look how close this is. May not have been given in my day, but the technology's certainly shown its worth here. <laughs> 
So back underway. Intriguing contest this, given the 2-1 scoreline. An unforced error, you've got to say. Podence. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, showing excellent vision. Now the task is to remain focused. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Can they stop it going in? Oh, and he puts away the second chance. But the goalkeeper angry with himself here. Well, here's the replay. Yes, it's a decent shot, but the goalkeeper has to do a lot better there. He's parried it out into a dangerous area, and suddenly the ball's in the back of his net. It's poor goalkeeping, you have to say. So back underway, 3-1 the score. Now we're into the final half hour. And the referee blows for a foul. Weston McKenney. And now Roldan. Space and time for the cross. Palinha is with Ruben Neves. Bruno Fernandes. Ruben Neves. Ronaldo. And a strong tackle. And with the goalkeeper. Palinha. Ronaldo gives it a go. Closing down well. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Well, as expected, Portugal have had more of the ball so far. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. And the substitution will occur now. Played over. No problems grabbing hold of that one. Oh, he's given it away. Almost at full time, and I'll tell you what, playing away from their home patch has been a pleasant experience for them, Stuart. Well, they've been much the better side up to now. Some of their approach play has been excellent. They just need to control possession for these final few minutes to cap off a really good display. And he read it well, intercepting it. Well, flinging himself up the ball. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Trying to pick out a teammate. 
He did his job defensively. Pedro Gonzalves. Bruno Fernandes has it. Excellent challenge. Weston McKenney. Miles Robinson. C. Batcher. And he read it superbly. High quality defending. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Timothy Weah. This looks promising. And the keeper making sure there were no scraps for them to feed on. And there it is, the full-time whistle here, and it's a victory for the visitors. Yes, Derek, fairly comfortable in the end, wasn't it? Thought they controlled the middle of the park for the most part, and going forward, there were some really nice, incisive plays as well. Good result for them. on what is a glorious night for football perfect playing conditions I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and sharing duties with me today Stuart Robson and if this game lives up to its billing we're in for a riveting occasion it's Northern Ireland up against Portugal thanks Derek well both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly hitting the opposition back playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible hopefully we get a really good game here
So the initial 11 for the home side. Well, it looks as though they're lining up fairly defensively with a back five. But I think the wing-backs will have license to get forward at every opportunity. And also watch out for one of the central midfield players going to join the front two. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Well, it's a 4-3-3 with two out-and-out -out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. And the contest begins. Ronaldo, and it's teed up for Ronaldo, high echelon goalkeeping there. Trying to deliver it accurately. Clears his lines. Happy to take on the shot. And a wonderful diving save to deny the opportunity. Can someone get on the end of this? He succeeds in clearing it. Oh, really good reflexes and danger averted. And he's fired over the corner. It comes to nothing in the end. Cristiano Ronaldo, one of the greatest players of the current era. And you'd have to imagine, Stuart, he's going to have some sort of role to play in this one. Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas. And he can certainly play in tight areas. He wriggles out of situations. He can find that penetrative pass. And he's such a good player when he gets the ball out of his feet and gets shots away. He could be the outstanding player today. And the perfect position to read it. Renato Sanchez. Bruno Fernandes has it. And it's a quality pass. Ronaldo. A oh, tremendous block. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, an ordinary header, and that's probably being charitable. Flanagan. Ferguson. Boyce. Now, potential danger. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance.
Renato Sanchez. Guerrero. Good looking ball. There could be a chance now. Ronaldo. Well, time just challenged magnificently. Shane Ferguson. And a good-looking ball. And thumped away. Palinha. Bruno Fernandes has it. Well, couldn't quite find his teammate. It was going to take an audacious effort to beat the goalkeeper from there. That is a wonderful challenge, and they've kept the ball to boot. Can they create something from here? And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, a wasted opportunity. It would have been a decent chance, but offside the decision. Snuffing out the danger. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. Tremendous block. And players waiting in the centre. And overcame the ball from the flank, but dealt with in the end. Bruno Fernandes. Renato Sanchez. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, here we can see it again. It's a beautifully weighted ball behind the back line. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. So the ball rolling again with the score line standing at 1-0. Just possessed there. Tremendous piece of tackling. Boyce. It did look on for them, but not to be. Well, getting very close to the half-time interval, and it's a narrow lead for the visitors to this point. Stuart, how would you assess what we've seen? Well, they've worked hard and played well to be in front here, but they now need to keep their focus as we approach half-time. Couldn't keep it. Shane Ferguson. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. And a chance to whip it in here. But dealt with efficiently. An alert intervention. Still behind, but the pressure mounting. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. Oh, just mistimed his run and the flag going up. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here.
plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Bernardo Sanchez. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? And a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. Happy to take on the shot. And it's gone in. Just what the doctor ordered. Things looking very bright for them now with this buffer. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. He skips past his marker, and that gives him the space to get his shot away. Excellent stuff from him. So, 2-0 now. Pedro Gonzalves. Excellent challenge. Good looking sequence. And it's going to run through to the keeper here. Dangerous looking attack. Well, it could be on for him here. Oh, a save of the highest order. Well, he got his angles absolutely right. What a good save that is. Well, this has to be their way back into the game. The crowd are certainly playing their part. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. And over it comes. Not the result from the set piece they were looking for. And they could get one back here. Well, he's missed the chance, and the keeper didn't have to do very much. He might be able to profit from the wide position. Bruno Fernandes. Sanchez. Well, wide of the target, but I'll tell you what, he didn't miss by very much. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Boyce. Washington. Not showing good patience. And just slightly offside. Portugal have control of the ball again here. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. And a good-looking pass. Michael Smith. Good-looking cross. Well cleared away. This looks promising. Ideal for the goalkeeper, for any keeper. Ronaldo striding forward with confidence. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Ronaldo. And effectively parried away by the keeper. Well, those stats tell you everything. They're opening up the opposition at will. And while we've seen some really poor defending, their attacking play has been excellent. 
20 minutes to go in this one. Losing possession a bit easily. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. Good tackle, take it away. Oh, showing excellent vision. Able to deal with the threat. Good control under pressure. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Good use of the ball, but can they trouble the defence? Happy to take on the shot. Oh, a nearly moment, but not quite good enough. Well, you certainly can't fault them for effort. They keep applying the pressure, and if they can just nick one, they're right back in this. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Sequeira. Ruben Neves. And Palinha with it. Well, it's a great advantage to any side when you're as comfortable on the ball as they are. Ronaldo lost it. Now we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one. Oh, big chance! Oh, a goal to reduce the deficit! My goodness, that gets the pot boiling! It's not over yet! Well, as you can see, he's given far too much space but he still had some work to do, and I think that's a very tidy finish. It was never in doubt. And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. Palinha. Well, with five minutes remaining and just one goal between them, still the prospect of late excitement in this match. Ruben Neves. Nicely timed tackle. Down by a goal. This could be the final opportunity to snatch something. Keeper dealt with it. And stuffing out the danger. Poor attempt at a pass, really. But the electronic board lets the fans know. Three minutes of stoppage time. Might be able to get in behind the defence. And Ronaldo tries his luck. And it's come off the keeper. If they can score again from this corner, it probably would be the end of the story. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Playing it in. No nonsense clearance. Neves. Shot blocked, but still alive. And so the final whistle here. The visitors come out on top, Stuart. Well, Derek, it was a really tight game, but they were the better side over the 90 minutes, and they fully deserved their victory today. Ronaldo. High echelon goalkeeping there. When I try to look, I wish I'd find 